Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Goals Bible Liverpool 2, Real Madrid 5. This is a stunning, stunning result. Full time, I mean, wow, just wow. After leading 2 0 with just 40 minutes on the clock, Liverpool look all but out of the Champions League after a stunning collapse at Anfield. They conceded five goals straight after leading by two goals. This is incredible. I've never seen this. I've never seen this. Real Madrid's uh, first actually came through some brilliant skill by Vinicius Jr. But the rest were aided by some dreadful defending by Liverpool. Uh, the European champions, of course, took their foot off the gas after scoring their fifth uh, goal. Perhaps they did Liverpool a favor in this one. They could have continued and smashed them even more, but they were actually content with the 5-2 lead. It's just disastrous from Liverpool standpoint. An extraordinary night, uh, in my opinion. I mean, I think Liverpool have been humbled here and they've been humbled despite making a dream start as Nunes and Salah actually put the Reds up by two goals. And after that, they just went to sleep. After that, they just went to sleep. They just took in five goals straight. And I don't know where they go from here. I really, really don't know where they go from here. But Madrid fans, they should be excited. And I'm a Madrid fan and I'm really excited about uh, the result here. Karim Benzema scored two goals. Vinicius Jr. scored two goals. Just focusing on Real Madrid uh, for a second here, I think it's been an outstanding performance from the champions. And this is why they, they, they call Real Madrid Royal Madrid because they're one of the best, uh, if not the best team in the Champions League. And they've done it time after time. Uh, they've won this competition 14 times and it is not a coincidence. Uh, we've seen last season they were down and out against Man City, against Chelsea, even against uh, Liverpool as well. But they always come back. They always come back. Against PSG, they were down and out and they came back and won that game. And tonight is no different. They were down by two goals in the first 14, 15 minutes and they came back and won the game by five goals. Defensively, you have to ask questions on Liverpool. I mean, Liverpool defense is just disgusting, to be honest with you. They made it just so easy for Real Madrid to penetrate and score a lot of goals. Um, back four, you got to ask questions. You got to ask questions from Liverpool up front in the middle of the park. Do they still have the energy to compete at the biggest stage of the game, at the biggest stage of the competition? Can they do it? I highly doubt it. I highly, highly, highly doubt it. And I think it's an end of an era, in my opinion, for Liverpool. And they're going to have to make a change. They're definitely going to have to make a change. I don't think Jurgen Klopp is a bad coach. I think he should stay for next season at least. But they need to make a change in the middle of the park. They need to make a change on this team. They just lost that edge. They lost that energy. Even the front uh, players are not performing as expected. Nunes, Salah, I mean, Firmino, Jota, all of them, they had a chance in this match uh, to do something and they just can't do it. They don't look strong as a team. And they, I think they gave up in that second half. The moment they conceded that third goal, they just sunk and gave up in this in this game. But it's dreadful. I mean, there's still a second leg to come about uh, in, this, in this competition. It's not over yet for Liverpool, but I highly, highly doubt they can go to Santiago Bernabeu and score four goals and qualify. So I think that the, the tie is over, in my opinion. The tie is over, but... Technically, there is a second leg to come at the Santiago Bernabeu in two weeks' time. We'll see what they're going to do there, but awful, awful game by Liverpool. But congratulations to Real Madrid for winning a stunning European night in this one. Man of the match, I would have to give it to Karim Benzema or Vinicius. I think I would go with Vinicius. Vinicius has done well in this match, scored two and assisted uh, one for Karim Benzema. Karim Benzema scored two goals. One is deflected. So all in all, I think they couldn't cope with Vinicius' pace. And he was just uh, causing them a lot of trouble all night long. And Vinny, for me, is my man of the match. But do let me know in the comment sections who is your man of the match and what needs to change for Liverpool. A lot of questions that needs to be answered. Do let me know in the comment sections. And 
thank you so much for watching and uh, smash that like on the video subscribe to the channel as always if you guys are new and i'll see you guys on the next video hala madrid